What's going on guys? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 3. As you can see, there's a storm moving in over there on our right. And, um, well, we're continuing exactly where we left off in the last one. But, in this one, we're not going to continue with racing or anything like that. This one's going to be a bit of an exploration episode. So, um, a while back, somebody commented on a video saying, Hey, can you do an exploration episode? I didn't quite know what the guy meant, or the girl, or whoever it was. Um meant by it, but uh, I'm guessing this is what you might have wanted, maybe, if the guy still watches my videos, or the girl, or whoever. But what we're going to do is we're in our Land Rover, uh, which we got in in the last one, and we're going to go um, here, and then over here, and get these two barn finds, and then we're going to head south. And then we'll probably just go here, then here, then up to here, over here, and then here and then up there and then back I guess but let's get right on shall we right I think right now there's about like 10 I think I didn't count them I'm guessing there's, I think there's about 10 but after we've done all of these there should only be five bomb finds left. Turn sharp left but um Turn I don't know left. how much of this we're gonna cut out as well um, I might cut out quite a bit, but I will show you where all the barn finds are. Um, right. On screen right now, I think what I'll do is I'll put a link. I think if not, it'll be in the description of the last barn find episode. Right. And then once we get the last five barn finds, the 16 in total, I think. I might be wrong about that, but I think the 16 in total, after we've done this, we should have um, 11, I think. There should only be five left what aren't on our map. But uh, I don't have a clue where the bomb finds are. I haven't bought anything like um, like the the map to tell me where they all are or anything. I am literally finding them by finding them. And that's the way I want to do it. And uh, I'm going to do this for a video for you guys as well. I think it will be a bit interesting. If not, you guys can always click away, I guess. Right, you let's try and find this bomb find. Right, what we're going to do is we're going to go external on the camera. There we go. Right, now let's try and find it. I think it's over here. I don't have a clue where it is. I'm just completely guesstimating. Now, it's somewhere in this circle. Let's see if we can find that. I'm guessing it's going to be hidden in the trees. Somewhere. Yeah, I'm guessing down here. Makes sense. Is it here? Yes, it is. Let's see what it is, shall we? Hopefully, the game don't freeze on us. <laughs> shall we? Yes, we should. Oh, I don't really like the green. It's a Holden Monaro GTS 350, 5.7 liter V8, circa 1973. Sorry, it's just this is an emotional moment for an Australian. <laughs> there we go, one down. So, um, I might cut out some driving and stuff like that, so... I hope I don't, but I might do. Uh, let's put it on this road. Right, let's uh, head that way now, shall we? I'm taking the Monaro back to the shop. I just need some time alone with this thing. Y you can have it soon. Turn around when it is safe to Just do clean so. up after yourself, buddy. I, I don't want no stains. <laughs> right, let's just head it down this train track. Now, there are trains in this, so I can get hit by a train if I'm not careful. But, uh, we'll head more or less straight meters. there. Turn left. Woohoo! In 200 meters, turn left. Right, slow down. Slow down. Right, there it is, it's over there. I think we can just head straight there now. But yeah, um, I think when we go down south, we might end up cutting a little bit. 
I don't know how long this episode's gonna be. It might be 30 minutes long, it might be 20 minutes long, I'm not sure yet. But we are more or less in the area. Let's see if we can find it now, shall we? I'm guessing this road here. Wow, okay, we're straight there to it, huh? Wow, there we go, found it straight away. Also, actually, I'll point out where the last two were as well, if you guys wanted to know. I forgot to show you on the map where the last one was. Let's see what all the fuss was about. Oh, it's a, um... Oh. <laughs> it's a reliant Ryan regal. Regal. This is a classic piece of British motoring history. You keep digging up classics at this rate, and this time next year, you'll be a millionaire. I knew it was a Reliant Summit, but I couldn't remember the second uh, word. It's Regal. There was the Reliant Robin and the Reliant Regal. I'll get this regal. cute little guy fixed up. Should still be a hoot to drive when it's finished. Yeah, that's if you like, um, well, I think they really needed to put roll cages in those things. But anyway, as you guys can see, um, this here is where it is on the map, if you guys wanted to figure out where that one was. Now, where was this last one? The last one is here, if you guys wanted to see where it was. Right there in front of the trees. Pretty, uh, yep. You guys know where that one is. Right, now we're going to head down south, all the way down here. Well, um, I'll put that on there. Right, this might be the one where we skip meters, to right. the location, but um, I think I trust the right vehicle. For this task, meters, turn right. of pretty much urban exploring kind of type of thing. Anyway, let's head on down. If there's a cut, guys, you will experience the cut now, probably. See you guys there. there for you. Right, guys, we have found it. It took me a little while to find it. Driven past the probably like three or four times, but uh, we found it eventually. This is gonna I'll show be you guys a good where one. it is. I just know it. Oh, boss, we stand in the presence of greatness. The Holden Sandman. See that faded paint? That's the Sea Witch livery. It's not a custom job. Holden had it like that in the brochure. Nice. Right, also, our Reliant Regal has also Back to the been. I'll get this fixed up and give you a call, alright? Has been, um... Uh... What's it called now? Um... Finished and fixed up. Right, we're mm -hmm. gonna head over here. I'm... Um, I don't know where it is exactly. That there was just a marker to show me where it is. But anyway, I'll show you guys on the map where that one is. Um... There you go. There it is. From that there, you guys should be able to find it. It's there, if you guys wanna know. There we go. Okay, let's move on to the next meters. one. Right. right, guys, I think I found her. I think this is her right ahead here. This is her right here. Let's see what we've got now, shall we? And also, I'll show you where she's at on the map as well. Sorry for the amount of cuts, but these, um, sometimes and are hard to find. Our next contestant? Oh, hello. Hmm, looks like a Skyline GTR. The V-Spec. Back in the 90s, these things ran right in the Aussie touring car circuit. Sweet. Get her back to the garage and fix her up for us then. Right, let's find the next one. Oh, it's starting to get dark. Right, now we're going to head up north. We're going to head to that one. And then this one. And then after that one, it's back up north and grab these two. Right, let's head over here then, shall we? Um, I hope we can find her pretty easy. I think she might be here, actually, to be honest with you. Let's head there first. Right, guys, I'll what I'm going to do... I'll get back to the shop and get to work. Feel free to check in if you like. I'll check in at some point. But, right, what we're going to do is I'm actually going to cut here, guys. And I will see you guys when we get there and when we find her, I guess. Oh. Right, guys, we're here, and we found it. It's right ahead of us, right here. Actually, no, hold on.
Right, guys, we have found it. She's right there. But there's one thing. I don't think I showed you where the last uh, bomb find was. Uh, it was this one right here. And there you go. You guys can hopefully figure out where it is from there. I'll zoom out there a bit for you. There you go. And I will zoom back in. There you go. You should be able to figure out where it is if you guys are following along. This one, um, I'll show you when we've unlocked it. I believe it's right here, though. Let's have a look. Yep, there she is. Let's see what we've got. We're going to get out. There we go. Come on, the suspense is killing me. Oh, okay. No way is that a Ford Woody. It is. It's a Ford Woody. This thing is like a priceless antique. It's like finding a Rembrandt in your garage. Well, for <laughs> me it is. There we go. Right, I'll quickly show you where this one is. It's getting darker though. Um, we put a marker right here on the end of this track. It is literally just south of that. So if you guys want to try and find it, I'll zoom out. There you go. There you go. Okay. Now we're going to head over here. And we're going to go try and find this one. So uh, what I'll do, okay, guys, again is I will... Uh... Surfboard and all. I'll let you know when you can have it. <laughs> what I'll do is... Well, the road's right here. It's just around the back of this building here. This is where we put the marker. But uh, what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to cut, and I will go over there, I will find it, and then I will catch you guys once I have found it. Because these things are sometimes really hard to find. But, um, yeah, I will catch you guys when we are there, and we've found it. Right, guys, I think I have found it. I think this is it right here. Here we go, we're here, we found it. I'll show you on the map where it is here in a second. Wow, that lens flare, though. <laughs> Every day is like Christmas morning with you. It's a Jag. It's oh, a jag. yes, it's a Jag. Mark II, if I'm not mistaken. 3.8 litre engine, racing livery. But none of that matters, right? I mean, it's a Jag. You feel classy <laughs> just standing near it. It's a Jag, all right. Right, I will show you guys on the map where it is. There you go. It's, um... I think the circle just didn't come and cut here around here, just next to this road. If you know where this road is, and where that little intersection is right there, you guys can pretty much figure out from where it is from there, and there's the overall size of the map. There you go. You now know where it is. And, uh, yeah, I will okay. catch you guys up... Here, we're going all the way up north. We're going to get these two, and then that is it. I think that's it. Yep, that's it. All right, guys, we're heading up here, and uh, I'll catch you guys when we're Take up there. Back to the shop and get it restored. I'll be in touch soon. Sweet, you better be in touch. Right, guys, I'll head up there now, and I will catch you guys when we get there. Right, guys, I think I found it. I think it's right here, one of these buildings here. Yep, here it is. Found it. Didn't take me that long to find, actually, this one. But it took me a while to come back. <laughs> and open her up. What have we got? It's like Christmas. Oh, hello. It's a, um... Will you look at those lines? Ferrari. This isn't just any Ferrari. <laughs> this is a 166. First car they ever won Le Mans with. The car that started it all. And the poor thing looks like it's been sandblasted. Yep. Looks like it has. Right, I'll show you where this one is. This one is, if you see these two yellow fields, it's pretty easy from there. There you go, you can find it there. It's right there. Circle is about here-ish. And there you go, you can find it from there. Right, we'll head up here, and we'll go get this last one, and uh, then we'll call the episode. So what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm actually going to cut until I find it, and then we'll continue from there. Taking this Ferrari back to the garage and restoring it to its former glory. I'll call you when I'm done. Sweet. Call me when it is done, buddy. Alright, let's go see if we can find this one. I'll cut now, guys. Oh. I think I found it, guys. I think it's right here. 
think this might be it. This is it. One Skyline GTRV spec, mate. Ready to collect when you are. Oh, sweet. That's ready to collect. Oh, I love this part. That's an FX. That's the first Ute Holden ever made. That is Australia's gift to the motoring world, right there. However, ugh, this one smells like it's had goats living in it. <laughs> so that is a mute. So there we go, guys. They are all found. So I'll show you where this last one is. Um, the circle was here. Um, all you have to do is really find these three fields, and then it's right up in the top left. Right, guys, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to call this one here. I hope you guys have enjoyed I'll this. I'll take it back to the garage. You just wait till I get it cleaned up and retuned. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. In the next episode, we are going to head down here and probably continue with our main races. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys have enjoyed. Give this video a like if you have. If it's helped, let me know in the comments. Any more you want to see or anything else you want to see in these episodes, let me know below and I will hopefully get to do that for you. Hope everybody's enjoyed this. Give it a like if you have. And I will catch you guys in the next one. For now, guys, I'm out. Peace, guys.